So it's four in the morning and I'm mourning All the versions of my person I could have I started using PRS guitars, um, I think it was uh, this summer when we uh, did our, our second US tour of the year um, and I started using the Silver Sky SEs, these lovely things and um, the, you know these have been my main guitars for months now and it's it's just been amazing like the the how comfortable they are to play and how it sort of fits into my, my rig as well at the same time. It was just so seamless and it just sort of, um, it was an instant sort of upgrade for me uh, personally and professionally. Uh, but yeah, the SE Silver Skies are my mains, and I've also used um, the Hollow Body 2 Piezo uh, for a few songs on our most recent headline tour um, to sort of cover the, uh, the dual acoustic and electric songs that we have. Um, and again, that one was amazing. Uh, you know, I, I love playing that one. I only used it for two songs, I think, um, per set, and it was always a little, little highlight, you know, a little change. Touring with Holding Absence is a lot of fun, um, mainly because like we're all sort of a family. Um, I know that's really cliche, but we've literally like all been friends for like ten plus years now. Like we like I grew up with our singer Lucas, and um, we met the rest of the guys when we were like fifteen, um, and we're all like pushing thirty now. So it's like you know we, we've literally like grown up together, and like we are our own sort of friend group, you know, outside of the band as well. So like when we're home, it's like you know, we all spend our time together. But like, that makes touring so much more special, I think, because, you know, it, it, it's like, it's a job, but it's not a job, because we all love each other so much, and we, you know, we all like look after each other, and look out for each other, and just sort of um, really make sure that everyone else is having a good time. Yeah, it's just fun. It's, just, it's always constant fun. Touring with the SE Silver Skies um, has been a dream come true. I've literally never had um, an issue on a single show since using them. Uh, tune instability is fantastic, you know, on and off of planes in cargo holds and like multiple different climates across the world and different weather conditions and whatnot. You know, like I've got them out of my case and it's they've just been ready to use. Um, I've never had any tune instabilities. I've never snapped a string. I've, you know, no electronics have ever broken. Nothing's ever gone wrong. Um, and yeah, I can only um, I can only put it down to just this amazing instrument and, and how reliable it has been for me. Um, so I love my uh, SC Silver Skies. Uh, one of the main reasons is I I'm a big fan of using like single coil pickups with um, high gain. There's just a clarity there, um, and just just this like it adds that sort of sparkle on top that like. I always miss whenever I use sort of like humbucking pickups. The the feel is amazing. Like I like they really just feel super natural to me and um and really open and um it just sort of you know allows me to sort of forget about like forget about tone almost and just like play and like feel and express through guitar. As you can hear, like in both sounds, it's like they're super clear, super punchy, um, cuts through the mix really well. Um, but you know, it's not like shrill and bright. Like a, you know, you hear some single coil guitars and like it, it can be a little bit ice picky. But in in both scenarios, they really just sort of um, it's just clear and it's just sort of emphasizes you know how the beautiful the be beauty of the music almost you know. So um, I just really enjoy the fact that I can do everything that I need to do for the band and all of the sort of genres that we cover um, with one guitar and with just, you know, these sort of beautiful pickups. Well, 
One of my favourite songs to play live is uh, from a new record. It's called Her Wings, and it's one of sort of the newer singles we put out. But it's just got this really punky, fast sort of um, feel to it, uh, and it's just non-stop. Um, and it always comes at the point of a set, just after like a lull. So it's always nice to get back into things and um, you know get heavy again almost. Um, advice I'd give to aspiring guitarists, there's, there's two things I'd say. Uh, the first thing would be um, don't feel like you have to copy anyone else. I feel like it's very easy to go on sort of social media these days and see all these like super shreddy guitarists or like, you know, guys playing like blues licks or whatever. Um, and there's nothing wrong with that, but I, I like I really sort of um, enjoyed finding my own way and like, you know, using my own inspirations to sort of create my own sound and my own playing style. Um, and I think that uh, it's, you know, it's sort of an important thing to keep in mind that you don't have to be like everyone else and you can just like do your own thing and pave your own way. Um, and then the second thing that I say to everyone who always asks is um, just keep going. It's so easy to uh, to give up and just be like, oh, this is too hard or, you know, oh, I can't be in a band, like we're not getting any shows or uh, I hate practicing, so I'm going to stop playing. You know, it, it's like the most important thing you can do is just keep going and keep going and keep going because eventually, like, things will like work out for you. Like, I've been playing guitar for 20 years, and then been in bands for like 15 of those. So, you know, and I've literally never stopped. Like, you know, me and like my bandmates have been in the same band together basically for like 12, 13 years now, and you know, there's never been a year where we haven't like been gigging. So, just keep going and keep going and keep going.